I have the role here of trying to give one university's uh, academic response to the world that Sam incarnates and that uh, Internet 2 incarnates. Now from the economy to higher education, the period of Euro-American dominance of this networked world is fast fading. Uh, we've now entered, just in these last couple of years, the first time in the last 150 years that less than half of the world's production came from the West. The world is miniaturized. We've discovered that boundaries don't keep out economies. They have never kept out ideas. They're not going to keep out people, and they're not going to keep out the effects of one society on another. New York is the first city in the world that could say that every country in the world was represented in its public schools by children that had been born in that country. Every country in the world. You can taste any food, hear any music, really hear any prayers by going to the neighborhoods of New York. And if you're, as NYU is, uh, a university without gates, without a single blade of grass, without, uh, without a campus, really, that's ecosystematic with your city, you embrace that city. In fact, we were founded, our founder's words were to found us to be in and of the city. And more and more we began to say to students in the admissions process, come to us only if you're willing to handle the cacophony, the complexity of the world that exists in our city. We're going to teach you the skills of building a, a community of micro communities, of being the elements of a watch. Uh, but if we can teach you those skills, then you'll learn that the whole can be greater than the sum of the parts. So Madrid and Paris and, and, and Florence quickly became general study away sites, and then we expanded it to the point where now we have 16 study away sites on six continents, having opened just this semester our sites in Sydney and in Washington, D.C. It is not a branch campus system. It is the best metaphor we've been able to come up with is it is an organic circulatory system. We were fully authorized by the Ministry of Education to be operating as a Chinese university as well as an American university. So we are, we, 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 we are binational in the eyes of the Ministry of Education. So now a student in the Bronx, in New York, or in Accra, or, or in Mexico City, or in Philadelphia, or in Beijing can decide to enter NYU through any of three doorways, uh, New York, Abu Dhabi, or Shanghai. This then is what we call the Global Network University. Uh, so in a way, uh, the faculty, the students, the staff of NYU are anywhere at any time. And uh, it's, 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 you don't just join a university in a place. You join the network and you circulate among it. Internet 2 has played a key role in this, and the members of the hub get access to, to everything. And in this way, working collectively with Internet 2, frankly, as uh, the key partner with this, putting together consortia of universities, will provide the backbone not only for our own global network university, but for many other as well. Thank you very much.